Oh, what do you make of this? That, that showing of Life Stealer coming out. Very quick response with that Razor. And we have a game one. Thunder Predator versus PSG LGD. So, Thunder Predator coming off a, a pretty hot last game. Of that last series. Let's see if they can keep it going. Or if uh, PSG LGD is going to bring some problems. It's already. Why? That's going to be first blood for, for Leo Stahl. So a very nice little bit of a boost for him. I don't know how how strong Life Stealer is. Um, I would put him somewhere closer to the bottom, especially at the like early stages. Once he gets the items, he's uh, very annoying to play against. Frank oh. diving in deep on the mid lane, a but Ame, lane. yeah, he gets the kill. Leo Stahl, is he going to be able to get why he is? Very smoothly done there as well, making sure he gets a right click in. Yeah, movement's below 25. Percent when that's maxed out and uh, 50 percent 50 attack speed, which is uh, pretty okay. Once you get that phase, Ooh. like it's very hard to run away from it. Moves with a with a lovely moves little eye shot there. with the moves with the moves. This man's got the power to moves you. Amen. Gotta die again. I mean, this top lane, they're they're doing an excellent job. Oh, the moves, nicely done again. Goes this back is... inside. <sighs> Unless you look at it upside down and then it'll look like it's a death instead of a kill. But as long as you're looking at it straight up, bottom lane. Moving over to Faith Bian. Minos is ready to dive in. And Faith Bian is going to try and run. They've got him. MJZ with a final punch, final ball of fire. Like, this is the perfect hero for Frank the yeah. tank. Like, if someone oh, can is. tank oh, that it much, is. it is Timber So, Ame. Good old Frank. Easy pickup. You can always rely on Frank. Frank. I mean, he just he doesn't die. He's not dying to this. Maybe if Y gets the stun. He's out of mana, has a magic wand in a second, I mean, then Moose a soul is ring. Over. Can Moose help him? Snowball. Oh, the snowball. oh that shot, though. Oh, that, that was beautiful. Moose. My goodness. This boy comes out with play after play today. Moose saving Frank. Leo style. Tanks the arrow uh, that's for not the Frank. Easy. That's but... Frank's job. I mean, I don't know why Leo style went in, but he did. Uh, even if he used the snowball there, like the region would kick in. Wait, what? Oh, he, he's he uh, cosplaying Siege Creep unit I love right it. now. Hey, mid lane, look at this go here. Straight on top of nothing to say with a supernova. My, my goodness, the out didn't stand a chance. And now with the coil holding Faith Beyond underneath the supernova stun, they're going to head over towards him. Frank cuts down a second. Double kill for Frank. And they will lose Moose in return, Jin Q and Y. And then you can be smarter than us. Yeah, you just have to finish the second grade, and uh, you got it. Is that after the first grade? Here we go in the jungle. <laughs> Leo Star rolling over. They've got the Dream Core down onto the two. They're taking out the Razor. They'll lose Moose. I don't care. Mars. Faith Beyond puts up the shield. He starts to back away. And Leo Star's in on top of them, and the magic damage between the two of them. It's going to slowly burn Faith Beyond down. Spear. Yeah, that will not do it. Earn of Shadow. Get some status resistance. That HP regeneration amplification. Oh, Frank. The shards. Oh, moves again. Oh, ho, ho. these shards are just the, the creme de la creme of shards here from Moos. Beautiful placement every single time. He traps them out. They can't run. They cannot run here. Now, why? He's trying to, but Frank's on top of him. Dream coil down. They're not messing about. They want the kill. They get the kill. I see Guardian Greaves. I press like because. Um, mm -hmm. You just want to be, you know, tanky enough, uh, extra mana region. You're playing against the Nyx Assassin as well. A lot of overtime damage coming out from that uh, Spirit Vessel and the Phoenix. I think Phoenix just finished off the Veil, so that's going to help out quite a lot. A lot of magical damage. Oh, oh. Supernova. Oh, that's a little far away. But uh, not that it matters, as Moose and Frank seem to be doing it on their own. Sunray comes out, MJ he didn't even need to be anywhere close with the Supernova. The job is still a successful one. It, you know, maybe round up at 10. Puck getting caught. Done. So he's going to need some backup. It's coming in. Frank's heading over. Jin Y and Faith Beyond. They're, they're sticking around. Actually, Frank's TP is going to be put to a stop. I believe probably cancelled in the mid lane. As uh, MJZ comes down instead. No supernova though, as MJZ will dive, dive away. Dive, has a healing salve. Ah, but the urn. Moonlight Shadow, yeah, Life Stealer. Yeah, you don't have any abilities. You can't really do much. You can just try to right click, rage. We'll get a kill on Nyx Assassin at least. 
More money for the farm of Minos. It's Frank. Look at the Lotus off so Concoction. It's uh, going to be quickly sent back over towards Nothing to Say. They'll get the link going. Frank is on the escape and he's got the backup. Moose comes over with the snowball. They're straight onto Arme. Arme just blown up at the front of it all. PSG did not with the means to, to be able to protect it. Thunder Predator have so much burst with the lead that they have. Like, even with the Spirit Vessel on Marana, it's going to be very hard to kill this Timber. So has a way of dispelling things once he gets that Guardian Greaves, which, you know, he still needs like five minutes to finish off. It's a costly item. So second way of dispelling things, some extra mana regeneration, which is going to be nice. And Life Stealer, he keeps farming. Oh, Spike carapacing the cleave of the Battle Fury to try and set this up. Why? Arena's down, but Minos, he's already put the race. They head over with the Snowball straight over towards Y. TP's coming in for PSG LGD. Y, he's going to be able to live here with the final team of the Spike Carapace, but they'll get the burst. This is a good Supernova. It's holding the high ground here. PSG LGD, they've got to really consider if they want to stay fighting around here. Infest keeps him alive as Minos is able to jump into moves, survive for this as they'll move on, diving up towards the Tier 3. The Sunray burning down Faith Beyond as four dead on LGD. But uh, he will be fight ready soon. And they still can't deal with Frank mid. Frank has just lived his life right underneath the tier 3 tower. He's even diving it. He's looking for Faith Bian. Bian will be able to save himself, pushing Frank back with the spear. That's where Minos, he's killed off Arme. And over towards the base, nothing to say is trying to turn up. This could be a bit problematic. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, Maybe. Sunray keeping he? him alive. They're healing him up. He's going to be able to get he the still has off. It He's good. fine. Frank is going to live. The Dream calls out on the three of them. The Supernova as well. Frank's still alive. The Concoction's pop out it. for nothing to say. The Snowball picks up Frank. Frank, he'll live. You can't flank the Frank. You cannot. Passive put. He didn't even flinch. Did not want to pop it, even though it's uh, 75 mana. Moose. Ah, uh, he can't get out of this one, can he? Well, I think he can. He just Snowball, punches. plus a blank dagger. Okay, he's he's okay. Like, armlet into Scotty, just to cripple both of them. Like, the regeneration is so good, the next are slow. Okay, look at Minos. He's just running straight in. He knows he's going to have the back of a Leo style. He comes in with the silence onto the two of them. Jump forward from Moose onto nothing to say. That's the out. Dead and gone for 50. Over towards why they turn. It's a good stun onto the three of them. The arrow comes out. It will stun Moose, but the heals are there from... this Phoenix just somewhere every time from MJZ. Keeping them topped up and not in a position for PSG LGD to ever be able to commit and actually finish off, finish anybody off. I feel like PSG LGD is not playing Dota. They don't have the answer for this Timber Soul. Leo Star, he's coming in. Faith Biano will turn with the arena. It's a swing and a miss. Leo Style pretending he's AFK. Look at that one. I, I love that. Is he actually? He is. He is. No, he's. He <laughs> he's is. Check box. Oh my goodness. They're feeling it right now, and he's going to jump back in. Dream calls out. They take out Y. They beat up Faith Beyond. As third, I believe this might be enough. it. They've yeah, they're enough. calling it. Nothing they can do anymore in this oh game. Like they goodness. got outplayed so hard. Like Timber, this Timber saw was causing so many issues. Like no. Here coming out from uh, PSG LGD, of course, one of the teams that is known to have quite the techies player in Zing Q. Uh, Tusk. Yeah, Tusk and Earth's pretty. They're. Yeah two best heroes that you can uh, have against the Shadow Fiend. Easy to go on him, a uh, ton of damage. Oh! Jinkyu! I found him! He's gonna try and get away, but Fisher the fish is up! Moves. Get Gets the first, first blood. blood. Oh, and the XD's coming out again! <laughs> I'm out! Because it was 250, it right? It was! I mean, there must be some really sort of big brain next level meme reason for it. It's the only excuse. Mid lane. Leo Style is wandering in for the kill. TPs are coming in. That's why we'll turn up. Leo Style will turn. We'll get his steward under the tier two. two. Can he get the kill in time? He can't. Leo Style goes down. PSG LGD turn their attention over towards Moose as well. As they'll be able to get the two of them here. That Punishing was the such dive. a nicely done move by nothing to say. He was waiting with the skewer for a very long time. Each time, yeah, they, they try and get a go on him, but they got to be very careful, especially as low as they are. Jin Q. Be ready to jump them if they commit bottom lane. Nice Fisher there from Moose as, as Arme just walks a little too close. Top lane, Jin Q will get the kill. Cost him his life as Minos is able to pick him up. Trying to run down Faith Beyond, but why? In with the rotation. And on top of the troll. Bit of a mischance from the Axis. Buying some time for Minos. 
but he can't run from this. The Astro from Faith Oh, he's he still alive. Enough. Raindrop actually keeping oh. him alive. And the sidestep dodge. Oh, he did. He, I didn't expect that. He didn't expect that. I guess that he didn't check for the raindrop. I didn't check for the raindrop. I guess Faith Beyond didn't check for the raindrop. You didn't check for the raindrop? I can see you, Owen. You have hands behind your back. No. <laughs> well, that raindrop. I mean, Faith Beyond is going to get a kill. Yeah. Like, this is oh, uh, pretty fog. And mid lane RP being dropped down onto Leo style. The follow up jump from Jin Q. He'll get the kill done. Down bottom, aggression from Thunder Predators. Franks diving in. Once Same, he'll get it with a swashbuckle. Snowball comes out from Y. The damage, also like the stun duration. Level 2 is okay. It's not like you're going to have a blink dagger straight away anyway for the Echo Slam. Eight minute room. Leo Star's going to be able to get it top. Why nothing to say? Trying to go for moves. Blast off off the mark. Jinkyu not able to find the damage. Arme's coming in for the high ground. Nothing to say with the two man RP. Locks down moves. And Frank Frank's still able to get the swashbuckle off. Nothing to say. He's up, in, up to the high ground. He'll make it out of there. Faith Beyond's trying to get in on this, but there's the chance for Minos to just close the gap, get on top of the OD. Slender Predator to get the two kills. Nature's Prophet has a TP scroll ready, so he can be the one getting there. DD rune and the bottle for Leo Star. Leo Star, they're still rolling in on him. He has got a DD. Why? He's very, very low. I mean, he's, he's just immediately dead. The Fisher ultimate position, and now they'll turn over with the control onto Faith Beyond. Two easy kills within the Predator in the mid lane. That's an early Yule Scepter pickup by Shadowfin. 10 minutes in and has uh, 1200 gold on top of that. Like, th this is a place where Techies wants to be, so they need to be a bit careful. Was that like one mind that brings him down to half HP? I think it was just Jin one of the Where's the raise at? He finds him. Leo style perfectly lining it up. The mines are gone. Frank, he's looking for Y. Finds another in the trees. And the Predator just getting kill after kill here in the mid lane. Leo style. He's stuck. He's got the Yule's control setting up for Frank to close in onto nothing to say. Thunder into the Red Grim. Not enough damage, though, being as far away as he is. Arme has TP'd it on top. Big the RP. There's the RP for nothing to say. Gets both Frank and MJZ. With the skewer forward, he'll land the slow onto Moose. Moose, is he able to make his way out of this? He isn't. The last hit coming in from Faith Beyond. Well, maybe it's morning where you are. I was always wondering, like, what would happen if two teams just, you know, agree we're going to come into the game, but we're not going to finish it. Well, I believe that would probably against a lot of rules. <laughs> if you what, where, where are those rules? I don't, I, don't think I, don't, I don't think I've ever read the rules that say, like, yeah, you have to finish the you game. You have to. Well, maybe, maybe there's some truth to it. Moose. Gonna drop down the slam onto Faith Good Beyond. roll. Gets the angle over towards Arme. We'll get Arme. Oh, the mines, though. They're causing issues for Moose. Moose can't get over. Jinku able to blow him up. One more raise from Leo Star will do it. Can he quite find that it? Was such a quick reaction on Yules. Oh, Shinkyu still alive. He's going to be able to turn front of a mine out. Frank's in trouble. Frank goes down. Shinkyu will finally fall. It's three dead on both sides. Blow up. Nothing to say. He needs uh, one more hero. Y is uh, very close. Moves. He's on to Faith Beyond with the echo. Astral will keep Faith Beyond protected momentarily. MJZ able to get off the false promise just in time. Faith Beyond. Finally taken out as Leo Star finishes him off with the raise. Minos able to get over towards Y. And now they're looking to dive in further. The mines go up, but it Troll isn't enough damage to stop Thunder Predator from diving in. Picking up two more for Minos. There's nothing to say. The only one surviving. The RNG normally tends to be good enough to, to keep it pretty much permanent disarmed. As you wish. That's Roshan. Minos, he's able to pick it up before PSG LGD can do anything about it. Now Minos, he's ready to fight. Head straight over towards the two of them. Up on the high ground, there's some mines set up here. They'll head up. Troll on the front lines. Fisher down onto the three of them. Franks leading over with the Rolling Thunder. Looking straight towards Faith Beyond. Gets the angle on top of Faith Beyond and Arme. Minos, he's on top of the Prophet. Arme's going to go down. Double kill for Minos as it's again a cleanup from Thunder Predator. They find the three and they lose nobody. As uh, mid lane, uh, coming in with the bots. As uh, a TP over from Leo Stars is going to set up onto this. There's Magnus, nothing to say. He tries to skewer out, but they've got him. Jump They're onto playing the Mac, takes so well, even though, you know, could be a meme game from uh, PSG LGD, but uh, also first big shadow fiend. They're oh, going they're in. The Frank is in. Frank. No, he's not getting out. The mines will take him down. They're able to trap MJZ as well. Pots the false promise on himself. I mean, I'm still trying to do his best to, to keep 
MJZ safe. He's not going to be able to do so. He's got a bail on this one. It's top. Here you go, Star. Yeah, got on by White. So sort of losing heroes up and down the map now. PSG LGD. Take over the outpost. Going into Scotty, just tanking up. I think he needs to swap. Like, when Troll is in melee mode, like, everything is red. I like the four items, but needs to swap face boots for something and the magic one to be color coordinated. Oh, mate. He's going for Frank here, and he's found him. We'll put the BKB worried about the jump in from Leo Star as Leo Star comes in. But they are ready to go. Oh, a bit of a whiff there between the Astral and the RP. And now the slams out from Moose. Leo Star's dead. So's for Faith Beyond. A bit of miscommunication there. Leo Star. Oh, the blink to increase the cast point and, of uh, the Strata Razors almost gets him. Meanwhile, in the base, Minos he has been trapped. Aegis is gone in five seconds. Oh, it's a little risky. He still got the back of, the, of MJZ with a false promise. Regeneration kicking in. He managed to take the barracks. We'll take the second one. They're still respected. The bombs actually used, so they know there are no bombs. I like how MJZ is just, from the precaution using Fates Edict just in case, even though Troll is super tanky. He's going into Hood next item. This is what I like to see on the Troll. 25 minutes in, skewer back into the tier fours. Incredibly tanky. His arm, eh? Oh, Leo style. He's pretending <laughs> to be AFK, the classic <laughs> move. I mean, he's styling on him. Frank's coming over. Well, who's styling on who? All right, I think Arme's the one who wins that one. BKB and a TP out after the Eon disc, he's fine. Who was it? Was it Sona Eco with the oh, four mid. hand of Midas is queued up? Mid. They He's dead. They weren't ready for that. Moose is getting to jump on nothing to say every time he tries to push out this mid lane. And now Leo Style, he's got the setup on a Faith Beyond. Faith Beyond heading over towards White. And laying down the raises. Swashbuckle comes in for the side from Frank. Jump across. They are rolling thunders there. Frank finding the angle over onto Faith Beyond. As Faith Beyond will come crashing down straight into the fissure of Moose. Have something to stop. These split pushes oh, come out from Ame. He's gone in. It's going to be safe for now by the Snowball. And he's very low. Another swashbuckle. Arme's dead. He's out of it. They've also ended up losing Y. It's just Jinkyu left alive. He'll try and blast himself back off to safety. Chase attempted by Frank. He's off the mark with the swashbuckle moves. Looking for the Fisher. Get we'll him. Get the catch. Get him. Leo Stars in with the raises. It isn't enough. There's a lot of mines going off. And it will kill Moose. I oh, mean, this is just very, very impressive stuff. A, a, a team to a Leo Star to be able to do this as with a Nothing first to pick SF. Watch the bottom Beyond. lane. Frank. He's over, on to Faith Beyond, and on to Y, Y. He's running, swashbuckle in, Faith Beyond goes down, Y as well will fall, and meanwhile on the bottom lane, Leo Style, he does. He does it with the Requiem, it's back up, thanks to those low cooldowns. They've had enough Thunder Predator, they don't want to waste any more time playing against the Techies lineup, they're looking to try and close the game. As they're over, on to the Tier 4s. It is time to end this, you know, they pretty much had their share playing in the pubs against Techies, all that hatred, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, you can feel it coming out right now. Oh, yeah, they want this over. They've had enough, they're trying to put a stop to it. The Sanities comes out, doesn't do a whole lot at all. As Faith Beyond's dead, Mino's back to business. Onto the Tier 4s, there's three dead on PSG LGD. See if Arme could do anything, he's trying to go for them on the back, he's got to put the BKB and TP straight out. He's having a run. Another attempt here in the Sprout, he'll get out with the BKB, he's away. I'll opt to take the tier three instead. Minos, ready to move over towards Jinq. Jinq, get him under the tower. He's rooted. He'll jump out with a blast off. Frank's heading over. Jinq nuked down by the raises of Leo style. And they can finally go for that throne if they want to. Oh, Frank! Frank, oh. not that tanky. No, Thunder Predator looked amazing. They they really did. So another did PSG win. LGD, but uh, another win in the bank for them. Was that the there jump? It is. There we go. The combo again. The Astral to buy a little bit of safety for Arme. He'll come out, put the he BKB. He can refresh and go in again with the Abyssal Blade if he wants to. Let's see if he wants to. He's holding on to it. Minos. Been trapped for now through the Sprout. I've got everybody back up PSG LG, but can they do anything to stop this trial? Minos level 25, Heart, Scardy, S and White. He is completely huge. 4k HP. But they have to try and burst through. Sentries being dropped as an offering around the Ancient. I believe even the Cheese placed on the floor as well. Sun the Predator. 
They are struggling to, to take down the ancient. I believe the Sprout causing some problems. Oh, he's in the... Oh, what's going on? The boom, Big boom. echo in the All fountain. All right. Okay. Thunder Predator, ladies and gentlemen. And that's how you go out. That's With the rampage, <laughs> that's what they've been waiting for. I mean, the, there's a reason why the fans love this squad. The buyback is to give it even more kills up for them as Thunder Predator. No.